What's going on YouTube? My name is Diesel and today we are back in the Black Watchman. I'm not Diesel, I'm Agent Diesel. Shaken, not stirred. Uh, what I have just done is Mission 19, Stronghold Alpha. Um, it wasn't that hard to, for me for some reason, but like it, it has some difficult spots in it where you gotta do just a, a little extra Google searches and you just realize that the information that's on your screen um, is a little, a little funky. They're kind of throwing you off a little bit. Nothing too crazy, though. Nothing too crazy. We're almost done. This is the end part of uh, the second to final mission that we're going to be doing. Not final mission. Like, there's six more missions left, but there's a... In the group. In the group. Here, you'll see. Let me show you. Third. Research history. Mission, mission 19. At War. This is the end of the At War chapter. Chapter is a good way to do it. And then we are on to the final chapter. Six more missions... And then we're waiting for season two, baby. So let's replay mission 19. Let's show you what I got. Hey. Finished with its meal, the lion walks away from the kill. He can rest easy knowing that his superiority has been proven once more in the battle against the rival male. Troops are on the move. Keypad ID is Alpha 0113. Go to your map interface and give directives to the field agent to extract the rupture bone before it's too late. We await your field report ID. The lion has suffered a few scrapes and bruises, but will live to fight another day. Alrighty. Hopefully uh, that's the last we hear of Michael Caine. Hopefully they bring back the very, very, very forceful black man. He just amped me up. He gave me some... Give me strength. Okay, enter the confirmation code upon completion of the strike. All right, keypad ID is A0113. Go to the global map and access the ongoing raid on Stronghold Alpha. So the global map is right here in uh, something I don't think I've ever shown on this uh, series. Uh, we've seized a code book from the trader. That's what we got it back. Yeah, we got that. We were working with the trader in the past two episodes. We're trying to figure out the trader. The trader, uh, we made a deal, sent him, uh, sold him some Magic the Gathering cards. Uh, use it to assist the strike force archive call number HW92T1. Now, Tijuana. Um, when we go to archive.blackwatchman.com and type in the archive number HW92T1, it gives you this document right here, which is not that. It is this. So we have Alpha, Bravo, Charlie, Delta, Echo, Dataset, Swan. Cephalopod, the shadowy land of the dead. N Nadine, I thought was, I thought this said nay nay, and I, I said watch me whip, watch me nay nay. Chaos, and then a bunch of codes. Now, uh, if you've been playing the Black Watchman, you notice that these are ciphers. We deal with ciphers all the time, and almost every single mission we gotta decode some stuff. You know what I'm saying? But it comes in individual code, and you gotta try and figure it out. Okay. Okay, so, but first, what we have to do is go to the globe. And it'll plop us down. Looks like Mother Russia. Replay the mission since I've already replayed it. Yes. And it gives us a little uh, house. Remember in the last mission we had a blueprint of the house? And now it's time to send in the boys. Ready, go, Team Alpha. Okay, enter front door combination to allow strike force to enter uh, into the end of the stronghold. Remember that they gave us A0113? A0113? Very good. That was the very, they gave us that, so that was an easy one. So, no big whoop, no big deal. Room Alpha. Help strike force and keypad access to room Alpha. Start now. Update from the field. The bombing of the guard room was successful. We need to advance through a locked door. Attached is a photo of the keypad. The door is marked Alpha Get Access ASAP. And it just shows us a picture of a keypad. It shows us the, you know, n different letters that associate with the different numbers on the keypad. No big deal. Alright, so it said Alpha, right? Yes, it did. Alpha team. So we go over to this bad boy, Alpha. It's the lock alpha data set swine and then it gives us a cipher so if you type in uh, into your Google search yes uh, mm -hmm. when you, if you type in swine cipher swine and cipher it gives you things like pig pen ciphers it gives you this stuff now I've watched enough history channel and seen a lot of uh, you know kind of like fun 
TV shows, giving us a little bit of the gist of the Masonic, uh, the Masons, the Freemasons. And I recognize this as it's a Freemason cipher. It's a, Mas it's a Masonic cipher. So I typed in Masonic cipher Dakota up here. It gives us this. So if you take our code right here, mm -hmm. let's, just, let's just slide you in. Okay, so you have this sideways triangle, the sideways, you know, you've got the triangle right here. It says T. Go into the bottom part here. Gets a little like an N, but actually it's the sides of this part of the tic-tac-toe, which is H. And then if you go over here, tic-tac-toe, looks like all four sides are covered. E, the. And then you go over to this side, you get D, O, I'm oh, sorry, D, E, and then H is an M. Whenever you see a dot inside of the little thing here, that associates with this, and so on and so forth. So if you see an upside down, like an up, like a V, like a V shape, that's an S. Uh, we have one for a W as well. Um, and what it decodes to is, the demon appears when the sun is in the ninth sign. That's what this decodes as. Fantastic. So we take that, we copy that, And we type in, the demon appears when the sun is in the ninth sign. The demon appears when the sun is in the ninth sign, ninth sign. So you go to your astrology and you look down to where you go to the ninth sign, which is uh, Sagittarius. Yes. It is, oh wait, no. Yeah, it's Sagittarius. Yeah. Sagittarius. Sagittarius is the ninth astrological. This is the oh, it's Aquarius. I was getting that's reason I was getting confused. I was uh, thinking of the song Age of Aquarius. Sorry. Sagittarius, uh, Sagittarius is the ninth astrological sign in the zodiac, originating from the constellation of Sagittarius. Gotcha. Okay. Ninth sign is Sagittarius. So what did that thing say to us before? It says the demon appears when the sun is in the ninth sign. So you think of type in demon Sagittarius, and it brings up. B U E R, Bjur, her, Fjörte, Fjörte. Yes. Bjur is the spirit that appears in the 16th century grimoire, Pseudomark, Demonum, and its derivatives, whereas a great flood president. Basically, he's a demon. Uh, he led great armies full of other demons. It's pretty badass. So, B U E R. So, you go over to your keypad. B 2. U is 8, E is 3, R is 7. So 2837. 2837. Come back to the mission. Now we have to go in through another window. Help Strike Force find keypad access to green Charlie. Where's Charlie? Updated from the field, we have a, we have sustained a casualty and one more guard is down. Help us access the next room. The door is labeled Charlie. Similar keypad as before. It just gives you another picture of the keypad. La di da di da di. Okay. Now, we shall head over to our Charlie page. Charlie, the shadowy land of the dead. And it says Beaufort and then some kind of code. Okay. 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 So, when you type in the Shadowy Land of the Dead. The first thing that comes up is Shadowland of the Dead, Japanese mythology. And it gives a nice little story, I won't say it's a nice story, about uh, Yomi, or the Shadowy Land of the Dead. Yomi. Izagari lamented the death of Izunami and undertook a journey to Yomi, or the Shadowy Land of the Dead. This will come into play in a second. So then, oh, don't, don't give me the terminology. I don't care about the terminology. I don't want to know. Shadowy Land of the Dead, and then you type in Beaufort. Now, if you type in Beaufort, it gives you a lovely little town in South Carolina. Let me tell you what, I'll tell you what. But, since it's a cipher code, I figured since this part was already taken, this is the part that kind of threw me off, because I didn't, like, Shadowy Land of the Dead, you're typing in Shadowy Land of the Dead cipher, and then you think that Beaufort is actually a part of this entire code that you have to try and uh, get together with. But no, um, it is not. Uh, so if you type in Beaufort, it gives you a, a lovely quaint town. Visit Beaufort, South Carolina. Official Visitor Center. Come on down and visit, and visit, visit South Carolina. Hi. I'm in South Carolina. 
But then you realize that it's a cipher, so you put in cipher. Pops in. There is such a thing as a Beaufort cipher. And it has a weird kind of uh explanation for it that kind of it doesn't make sense to me but I just saw as I was typing in Beaufort cipher and I saw decoder and I was like uh, sure hook me up with that so Beaufort decoder so you type in the cipher text in here so can't do it and I can't even cut copy paste I'm just gonna put this off screen here so I can type it in for you C H E X U Q Y O G D I E J G T F U T Y O H W O U E X J R U O A Q. Now, it needs a keyword with Buford decoder. You put in a bunch of jibber jibber jabber in the in the top thing. I'm not sure how the code works. I I don't know. I'm not a smart man. But when I when you type in a keyword so that it decodes off the keyword through a bunch of different numbers. If I showed you a graph right now. I still probably couldn't explain it very well. But you need a keyword in order for the cipher text to decrypt. Now, what is the shadowy land of the dead? Yomi. So you type in Yomi. And then decode. And it decodes to while you sleep. It devours. Whoop, not pit, not Brad Pit. I'm not doing that. Sleep, it devours your dreams. Type that bad boy in, copy paste, and then you put, type in, since the last one was Sagittarius Demon, while you sleep it devours your dreams, it comes to a spirit. Just type in, while you sleep it devours your dreams, Baku. I didn't even actually check this out to be honest with you, I just saw Baku, I was like, well that's gotta be it. Are Japanese supernatural beings that devour dreams and nightmares, according to legend, they created... Uh, they were created by the spare pieces that were left over when the gods finished creating all other animals. They have a long history in Japanese folklore and art, and more recently have appeared in Japanese anime and manga. Of course, since we've been doing magic, the gathering, let's throw in some anime and some manga, let's do it. So yes, Baku is your answer. So head over to your keypad, B A 2258 fantastic, looking good. 2258. Beautiful. And back to the mission. Room Echo. Help strike force and keypad access. Uh, gain even force. Find keypad access. Okay, I'm sorry. To Room Echo. We believe the rupture bones are inside. Ahead, take the start. Update from the field. We have reached the attic. Two more guards down. The rupture bones are likely behind this door marked Echo. We need the code agent. And this gives us another keypad. So we got to go over to our little fun spot. We got to bring it back over. Hi, Echo, Chaos, and looks like hieroglyphics. So you hop into your Googles, you do your thing, and all you do is type in Chaos Egyptian Hieroglyph. I, was, I went for hieroglyphic and then it uh, corrected me because I'm a dummy. And boom, right at the top. Apep. This article is about the ancient Egyptian deity. Was well, the ancient Egyptian deity who embodied chaos? That's all I needed. So you go in here. Apep. A two seven three seven. Two seven three seven. All right. Two seven three seven. Because of your support, the raid succeeded. Our forces neutralized the enemy guards and obtained the rupture bones within the facility. Stand by for confirmation code 9 1 8 Tango Charlie. Remember it. Repeat 9 1 8 Tango Charlie. Well, alright, alright, baby. Alright, so back to Michonne. Agent map. Let's head back over here. Head back into our mission and you type in your confirmation code, which was 918 Tango Charlie. Submit. The raid has been successful and a major blow has been struck against Morpho Medical. Our commander plans to arrange a meeting with them. We have the upper hand and we can now end this war on our terms. 
You earned your stripe on this one, Agent. Goddamn right I did. I'll tell you what. Alright, so... We are done with Chapter at War. And we are entering our last six episodes in Season 1 of The Black Watchman. Folks, if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit like. It helps my channel out ever so much more than you know. And if you could also go ahead and hit subscribe too and share this with your peoples. I got new videos coming out every single day, every single week. So folks, have a great day, afternoon, evening, good night. Peace out, like, shout, and I will check you out right here again in The Black Watchman next time.